Namasha said she was elected in the presence of the Damara king to ensure that the election process was fair. In her first act as chief, Namasha's vows to address the issue of the Ngomaning land, which they lost years ago at this year's land conference. ...that is preparing the land conference in October 2018 mm. to say, here we are still waiting as the Komani community because every place, including the boundaries of the Komas, has been taken um, by the city. It's the land of the city of Vantuk and it has been sold to individuals that has set up estates and that has set up Elisenheim, that has set up Omeya, that has set up a, a, a resort in Damfelyun, so we of don't Dumpling have replacement. land. She stated that Juliana Governors is not the queen of the Ngomaning clan, as her late father was a chief who was appointed by the Damara king of the seven clans, adding that after her father's appointment as chief, they introduced kings and queens through customary laws that went against the wishes of the Damara king. You are referring to mm. Yosefat governor, mm. and he has not been the king. No, no, no. He, he is not the king, he mm. was a chief. That selected was actually Eustace. selected by mm. King Eustus Garwe like to take others. care of the common in traditional yeah. community, he pass like away? any other person. So. King Eustus did that in his capacity as the king, as king. of the Damara people mm. to give us the chief Josephat government. Chief mm. Josephat government. Mm. So chief Josephat government, the late chief Josephat government, may his soul rest in yeah. peace, gave his daughter when he was actually not even elected as a king or appointed as a king. Well, Instead, well, he inherit, was inherit selected <laughs> as a chief. Mm. And so he put himself maybe as a king and then make his daughter the queen. According to Namases, the so-called queen, Juliana Governors, only has 15 followers left that are primarily family members and friends.